Hi guys, I'm here with Prada. We're gonna talk about gifts for him for Valentine's Day. Some of them are really specific to Valentine's Days, or Valentine's Day. <laughs> Otherwise, you might even think of some of them for later in the year, like um, Father's Day or birthdays or stuff, maybe even Christmas if you're way, thinking way ahead. But um, for Valentine's Day, um, a couple of the things that I have on hand um, for him, and these are not in any particular order, priced um, just sporadically. There's no high to low or low to high. Um, this is one of my favorite things. It's a Gucci uh, business card holder, and it's really nice. There's um, slips in here, or not slots, I guess is better, that you can put um, credit cards in, a place to put maybe cards that other people give you, and then on the inside, you can put your business cards on one side or other people's on the other. Um, you can, there's a, you know, a few different, or use credit cards and your ID. So it's kind of a nice way if you're doing business or at a networking or conference event, um, which I know my husband uses this for that. Um, but I love this and I think that it really is a classy uh, gift and also it's a really class act for them to show up with something so nice. Um, and Gucci you know, is a really nice quality one. So next on the list, um, is these Cobra headphones. These are wireless. They use Bluetooth. Um, you just kind of stick them around your neck um, and you don't have to connect it to your phone, which is awesome. Um, that's good for anybody, I think, regardless of if they work out or just in general, um, so you don't have to have that old-fashioned wire in the way. Um, next thing is bourbon. I know it's very popular right now. My husband loves it, but I know he's not alone because all the restaurants are carrying different old-fashioned drinks and things like that. So bourbon is definitely um, something that you could write a cute, cute note, um, and you know, with a nice card, um, you know, something uh, cute, you know, val Valentine's Day, or if you know, you can make it more um, towards anything else. But right now, we're focusing on Valentine's Day. So along that same line, these are some nice glasses. And I'll link to all of this stuff below. Um, these are personalized with um, our last name and uh, Hill, our last name, it has an H. And then another idea that I saw on Pinterest multiple times in kind of different ways is to get like a heart box and put um, like little travel airline sizes of bourbon or whatever um, liqueur maybe that your guy likes better and put these in a heart box and on the one side it says every minute I'm not with you is a minute wasted and I just thought that's a really cute fun thing to do I'm gonna try to add something like that on um, to the gift that I'm giving because I just like that idea and he loves bourbon so I think he would get a kick out of it um, so another thing um, this is always a good gift um, CE Bigelow products you can get them at Bath and Body Works um, this is nice for a man. It's a peppermint oil, um, body wash, and it has vitamins in it. Um, very refreshing, invigorating. Um, and it just, it's, this isn't going to break the bank. It could be an add-on gift. It could be your only you know, gift, um, depending on you know, what kind of things you all do for Valentine's Day. You know, I think it depends on you know, the precedent that was set and also the budget and stuff like that. Um, I know we're traveling extensively this year and so I think you know I told him not to get you know get me something overboard and I'll get him something but it's not going to be you know a car or anything crazy um, this is aromatherapy associates de-stress muscle gel and this is a great gift because it's really nice really soothing on muscles and stuff like that and I know I've um, massaged this on my husband whenever he has a sore shoulder or sore muscle um, it's always good for Valentine's Day to offer a massage and a really nice muscle gel to go along with it. Um, and of course, your massage goes with that, so um, he'll like that. Another thing, um, and this is a beard balm, or I'm, called, I'm sorry, it's called Stubble Balm. And this is great for, um, if they keep their beard short, if, if they have a beard and they keep it short. This is from The Art of Shaving. They have awesome products, that, especially if they have sensitive skin. My husband has really sensitive skin and he loves their products. Um, in that same family, there is the four elements of the perfect shave. And this is um, a carry-on friendly kit. So all of these things go together and it has in it a brush um, that has shaving cream, brush, 
or brushless shaving cream. Um, what is that? Aftershave balm and pre-shave oil. And so this is everything they need for a nice shave and it can go, on, you know, even in a carry-on. So that's a nice one too. Um, since we're talking about traveling, I guess, <laughs> I'll segue into packing cubes. They're great. They keep everybody organized and stuff compressed. There's different colors, like um, we do workout gear in green because it means go and stuff like that. Um, you know, sometimes I think of red as like maybe my more like going out, like you are wearing something that's going to be like maybe sexier or something like that. I put <laughs> That's just how my mind thinks. Other people probably do it the opposite. But um, anyway, so that's that. These are still good, um, but they have better versions of this. Um, these are the Bose noise canceling headphones, and these have the wire. I know they come now wireless, and that probably would be preferred um, in most every case at this point. But these do um, still have their place, and so we're not throwing them away because they still work. And I think like sometimes if you don't have a way to plug something in, if it like, or if it come, you know, uh, what's it called? Like loses battery or whatever, then these are good because they just plug in, you know, to whatever device you're using. So those are awesome noise canceling headphones. And another thing, and this is, you know, really very simple kind of tossing this in and it could be just a really sentimental sweet gift or it could be an add on. And it's, you know, just a frame. You could get a nice frame at, you know, Nordstrom or Macy's, or you could get one at Hobby Lobby or the dollar store, depending on, you know, your budget and how much time you have and where you're going to be. You could kind of get, the, get this together pretty quickly. Um, you could even print out a photo at CVS from your phone and pick it up on your way home from work or something like that. Pop it in a frame with a nice, you know, sticky note, I love you, or, you know anything you know use your own words or whatever um, or a nice homemade card or a nice store-bought card and I think that could be a really sweet um, either gift in and of itself or add-on another one um, is I had originally gotten this for my husband as a travel wallet it has room for business cards and stuff like that it has compartments that you could put a boarding pass in and check or whatever over here it has another thing over here that is a zipper um, for money or change or whatever and it has space on either side of that to put other stuff. He has um, Some Christmas thing I gave him <laughs> but um anyway um, I thought he was going to use this for travel and he wound up really enjoying it and he carried this <laughs> around and it actually Was funny because it started to bother me because he would have this in his hand and I'd be like hold my hand like, Put I'm like you want me to hold that for you so you can hold my hand so Anyway, you might be surprised. Um, he really liked having all of this stuff and it's easy to tote it around and it's manly and stuff like that. Um, and now he's kind of phased back into a smaller type of a you know, wallet, um, more like to the Gucci um, uh, style. So that being said, if you really wanted to splurge, you could get luggage. This is a nice big Tumi bag. Um, and this is, these last, they have a great reputation. Um, we also use the Delsey lightweight bags, um, especially for my carry-on. I have a lightweight Delsey, um, and it expands. It has a little compartment for shoes in the bag, and I'll link to those um, uh, if they're available. Otherwise, I'll like, do the closest thing in proximity to it. But these are really um, durable. They have nice features on them, and they just... Um, are sturdy so they wear well if you don't like black they have different kinds of colors in the same idea and you can always wrap like a belt bag around or like put like a pom-pom like this misses like stands out when you see it and stuff like that um, to you know really spot it quickly when you are traveling it doesn't need to be bright pink the whole thing you know you can just kind of put a little thing on it that you know it's yours those stripes that kind of wrap around I forgot what they're called but those are really good too so in a nutshell, I think that's pretty much it. Um, always a nice, you know, card or, um, you know, personalized things. Whether you make it or buy it doesn't even matter. Or if it's just a sticky note with a nice message or, you know, lipstick and a kiss or something like that. But anyway, I hope that you got some ideas. If you have any more I can add to my list, please put it in the comments below. 
And if you have a different version of something like this that you think is superior, please let me know in the comments as well. I'm always looking for the upgraded version or something better. That's why we're constantly shopping. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.